Konferensi Internasional Gandhi's 150 Birthday Anniversary tahun ini digelar di Nongchok, Bangkok, Thailand. Mengangkat tema renewal of non-violent movement in 21 century toward peace inspirations from sacrifice of Afro-Asian leaders, kegiatan ini menghadirkan peserta dari berbagai negara seperti Thailand, Malaysia, Pakistan, Afghanistan, termasuk Indonesia. Dari Aceh, Dr. Muklisudin Ilyas, aktivis di bidang publisher dan peneliti mendapat kesempatan diundang pada acara ini. Ia kemudian menyerahkan buku Pendidikan Dayah di Aceh Karangannya dan buku Acehnologi Karya Kamaruzaman Bustamam Ahmad di akhir acara. Sementara penanggung jawab International Institute Peace Development Studies atau IIPDS, Muhammad Abdus Sabur menyampaikan pesan khusus bagi Aceh sebagai daerah yang dilanda konflik panjang sampai akhirnya bisa menikmati perdamaian. Syedara Lun berikut selengkapnya video kiriman Muklisudin Ilyas dari Bangkok, Thailand. Aceh when there was a tsunami yeah. that time I went to Aceh me and Ikraj. Oh, yeah, yeah, and yeah. I'm happy that Ache has been reconstructed yeah. and still work is going on, yeah. more to be done. Yeah. And uh, Ache is a kind of example oh, yeah. how people can fight for rights. Yeah. Yeah. And once uh, year, uh, war is over, yeah. we need to reconstruct, okay. we need to live in peace. Yeah. At the same time, Ache also need to think like similar struggle going on in different parts of Asia. Yeah, yeah. How Achenese people can share their experience yeah, yeah. and their wisdom yeah. so that they can also achieve their rights yeah. and they can also be like Ache. Yeah. So young generation, elder generation, yeah. everybody uh, can share this experience so yeah. we, can, we can be in harmony, can yeah. live in harmony. Yeah. At the same time, it's, it's not only structural change. Yeah. Structural change means people uh, are taking power now. Achen is very often, many places, after independence, yeah. those, who are, those who are in the government, yeah. very often they also get isolated from the people. Yeah. Yeah. They seem to serve themselves, yeah. like they behave like any other government. The question is, we should not forget what was the objective of our struggle. Mm -hmm. And it is the struggle to establish the rights of all the people. Yeah. And particularly excluded, excluded majority, those are poor, yeah. those are migrants, yeah. those are helpless. Yeah. How to empower them and how to build their family, yeah. how to make progress in their life. Yeah. So that will be real achievement. It is not, not only yeah. change of power from Jakarta yeah. to Aceh, yeah, yeah. but Aceh is how they are using this power uh, yeah, to establish yeah. justice, yeah. establish equality, mm -hmm. and no discrimination, yeah. and people living in peace. Yeah. Okay, Abba, thank you for your comment this point. <laughs> thank you, Abba. Assalamu alaikum, Abba. Assalamu alaikum.